Hey guys, welcome back again to my channel and for today's video Mama's gonna be opening some box. This kind of almost like a series now because this is my third video opening a box for drugstore products that are new out in the market. But yeah, I can't wait to see what's inside this box. I mean, I know what's in this box, but I kind of forgot what's in this box. You know what I mean? Because I ordered this, but it's been a long time, so I have no clue what's in it. Anyways, if you wanted to see what's inside this box, then just keep on watching. So we will be opening this. Where is my scissor? Where's my, there you go. Calm down, calm down. Here's the box and there's the receipt. Let me see how much stuff I got. I got a ton of stuff. Now I'm pretty sure I bought a lot of brushes from them. So there's really not much in here. And this is everything. Now I ordered almost all of their brushes because they're freaking cheap. 0.99 cents. Where else can you get them? I mean, you can get them an elf, but still. It's been a long time since I've wanted to get my hands on these babies right here. But I don't know why every time I go on a drugstore, like an actual store, they either have like a couple of these only and I don't want that. I want to be able to see the whole collection and choose from them and then buy everything that I want. <laughs> So we'll talk about the face brushes first. I realized I didn't get much for the eyes. From what I can remember, they didn't have much for the eyes there that I really like, that I use. You know what I mean? I got their blush brush and this is how it looks like. And oh my goodness, this thing is really, really soft. This is a blush brush, it says. But it's a flat brush. I feel like you can contour with this more. That's weird, but anyways. Next is I got their contour brush. Make it a little bit. Everything is flat. This almost has the same purpose to me because they're really flat. Next is a flat top brush. And I'm guessing this one is for foundation. Ah, uh, reshape yourself. So yeah, this one is a flat top brush. Can't wait to try this for foundation. Next is I got like a small stipple brush. I feel like this is gonna be perfect for concealers. Look at that. It's a stippling brush, so it's very useful when it comes to cream stuff. And this one, I guess, is for foundation. This is a much bigger one. Although I hope it's much more fuller than it is. Because it's kind of not that full, but we'll see. Next is I got their powder brush. It's flat again. I guess it's just how it's packaged. But hopefully these will reshape itself to its normal shape. But yeah, this is a powder brush. And it's kind of big. I mean, you can tell. I can't wait to try those out and make like a, an all-out drugstore makeup tutorial from brushes to the products that I'm going to put on my face. So I got only three um, eye brushes. These are their crease brush, their petite small eyeshadow brush, and their smoky liner brush. The smoky liner brush, I would use this for smoking out that lower lash colors because it's really precise. Look at that. It's really small. I have like a Morphe like this um, and I use it mainly to highlight my brow bone area because it's really precise and just it gets there it gets there next is this the eye brushes are 99 cents and the face brushes are two dollars point 99 cents which is still very affordable now this one is their crease brush it's very tapered as well but a little bit thin and narrow next is their small eyeshadow brush so this is the brush and I don't know if you can tell but it's kind of slanted I don't know if that's how it's supposed to be I really can't wait to try this brushes out and make like an all-out video for a drugstore because that's one of the things that I really really want to do like every time I make like a drugstore makeup tutorial I want to be able to use drugstore products as well like no brushes as well because it's like it's cheap and it's cool and I want you guys to have it so next are I got some concealers these actually cost for 3.99 cents which is really really affordable um, I got the shade light medium beige and medium tawny but yeah, I got two shades because I wasn't sure which one is mine. The main purpose for this concealers are kind of like for no flashback purposes. Because that is true, some concealers does create flashbacks on camera which is really ugly. I like the creaminess. It's very creamy and it has a good coverage in it. Look at that. This light beige is really really light on me. But the other one is kind of dark but I think it would be enough for me. But yeah. Can't wait to try this. Next are, I got some foundations and these are their Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. I know these are new. 
This actually retails for $5.99. Anyways, I've heard so many good reviews about it and I can't wait to try these out. I feel like I'm gonna do like a review for this and for the next one as well. Oh, I'm so excited. Next are I got their Wet n Wild Pressed Powder. I got two as well. These retails for $4.99 and I got two shades again because I wasn't sure which one is mine because they have so many ranges of colors. Uh, I got the golden tan and the warm beige. This is golden tan, which is actually still light on me. You see that? I'll probably use that to set my concealer or something. So this one is in the shade warm beige. Of course, this is really, really light to me. The consistency of this, it's really buttery. It reminds me a lot of eyeshadows that I really, really love. It's buttery, but it's really blendable. Some powders really just like powderize themselves even if you don't do anything. You just touch them and it's like powder everywhere. But this one, it's not. It's very buttery. So I feel like I'm gonna like this. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know this is just a quick video. I just wanna show you guys what I got. But don't worry, these unboxing videos that I am making will have another part which is reviewing them as well trying them out and if some of them i've tried out what are my thoughts for it and everything along those lines and that will be coming up soon but yeah thank you again so much guys for watching please give it a thumbs up if you did like this video and comment down below what you think subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you guys on my next video bye